Then a big blow to Congress MP uh, Karthi Chidambaram. Uh, the Enforcement Directorate has filed a charge sheet in Delhi's uh, Rouse Avenue court naming Karthi as number one accused in the Chinese visa scam. Uh, this is on charges of money laundering. Seven others have also been named in the charge sheet. I have my colleague uh, uh, Neeta joining us. Uh, Neeta, tell us uh, uh, this latest uh, uh, you know, charge sheet against Karthi Chidambaram. What is it about and who are the others who have been named as accused? Uh, Vasudha, uh, the Enforcement Directorate has filed the charge sheet against 52-year-old Karthik Chidamram, who is the Congress MP. Uh, the case is that we visa was given to 263 Chinese national way back in 2011 and 50 lakh of uh, you know um, payment was made uh, for issuance of this visa. This case of enforcement directorate stems out of the CBI case. The CBI case is uh, that the CBI FIR states that 50 lakh uh, kickbacks was received by Mr. Karthik Chidamram uh, by a top executive of Vedanta group. Actually they were setting up a power project in Punjab and the uh, the project was running behind schedule so uh, these uh, these people needed a visa to be extended and when the visa was extended uh, kickbacks were received by Karthik Chidamram the, the CBI FIR says that now ED also uh, has uh, the same FIR uh, based on the same FIR they have also charged Karthik Chidamram under PMLA however Mr. Karthik Chidamram has claimed that this is a bogus case and uh, they obviously want to target his father Mr. P. Chidambaram. Not only that, he says, I have not even got involved in issuing of one visa, let alone 250 uh, visas, which the ED has mentioned in the charge sheet. The charge sheet was filed on 25th of January. The court is yet to take a cognizance. The court has uh, set a date for March 16th when uh, the case would come up for hearing. This is the third case in which Enforcement Directorate has charged Karthik Chidambaram. The previous two cases pertain to INX Media and also Airsel Maxis. Vasudha?